everybody, it's Christine of Twinkle Plans for Day, and today I will be planning the week of December 7th. I will be using these three sticker books, Winter, Merry and Bright, and then the other Winter book. I took out specifically this sheet because I am crazy about Santa. I love this sheet, and so I wanted to use it today. You'll have to excuse my laryngitis. I've been screaming all day at work because of the masks. Nobody can understand you, and so you end up talking louder and <coughs> and you're ruining your voice. So I took out these and I took out some blue and red boxes and different elements. I wanted to uh, use this color scheme. I think it goes, the blue goes well with the Santa. So I'm just gonna start putting the boxes on the certain events that I have and just take it from there. And then I'll add my little Santas. I just love this sheet, so excited about it. And I have my little Santa mug to inspire me. And I have my bottle my bottle brush little trees next to me to uh, keep me in the spirit mood, in the Christmas mood. So I'm gonna take these pages out and we'll get started. Okay, so from here on out, I'm going to speed up the camera. There's my after the pen from last week. I loved how festive it was. It really brightened my spirits because being a teacher right now is really hard, especially as the holidays are coming, da are coming down. So I need another bright and cheery spread to remind me that Christmas is coming up and there's a big Christmas break coming. So I have that big square for Friday because I'm having a planner meetup. We're gonna be as COVID, as safe as possible, but my friends insist on having it. So we will have our um, our COVID, <laughs> COVID safe planner meetup on Friday. And then I'm cutting up some other bra uh, boxes like for staff meetings and things. I'm coming in early on Monday, so that's to remind me of that. So every, Every time I have a box, it's basically telling me that I have to be somewhere or, or do something important. And I basically have it in my head. Sometimes I have it in front of me written out, but this is a pretty easy week. I know what's going on. I don't need to reference anything. Also that truck I'm probably going to cover with a Santa. Now I have that big ho, ho, ho. I was debating about whether I should use it or not because I didn't really like the font but I decided since I'm going with the blue, might as well use it. And then I wasn't, then I didn't know where I was gonna put it. As you can see, I'm hemming and hawing everywhere. So I decided the upper right hand corner, which means I have to take off this sticker, which took forever to take off. Actually cut out part of the video here because it took forever, but I was able to salvage that sticker. And I was able to add that ho, ho, ho. And the more I looked at it, the more I thought it's pretty cute. Sometimes I do that. The more you look at a sticker sometimes, the more you like it. So I like to layer some of these boxes, alternating the red and the blue. And I'm worried that there's not like one strong focal point in the spread, but it didn't bother me. This is gonna be basically a functional spread for me this week anyway. It's an easy week for me because I have two days for parent-teacher conferences, but I do have a lot of things that I have to remember and do. So I am gonna be using my planner in particular this week more than usual and I have these little banners that I'm putting out I think they make it a little more festive a little more pop of color a little more layering and after a couple more boxes I'm going to take out my Santas then I get to have fun putting them all around first I'm going to cover up that truck not that I don't like the truck, but this is a Santa spread, so I just wanted to have Santas everywhere. So when I, when I have a theme, I really stick to it. I just wanna make sure that I don't go overboard and I don't wanna make it too busy. But I do need boxes uh, for all these different events, meetings, and things happening. So here's the ho, ho, ho. And I might, when I put that down, I might put a Santa next to it. But I'm gonna add some more boxes and I'm cutting the top of this one just so the boxes stay uniform. There's a lot going on, so I wanted them all to be the same kind of box. So I'm adding more Santas and I'm really having fun with the spread. I know it's not like the spread of the year is not gonna get a thousand likes, but sometimes you just gotta have fun with it and just make it a useful spread. Like not every spread has to be like 
creative. <laughs> I know this is not creative. I'm just having fun putting stickers in my planner. And again, as I said, this was going to be like more of a functional spread for me. I am going to be using my planner a lot this week. I've been trying to concentrate more when I'm planning to have more fun with it. So I'm taking less time to worry about where I put stickers, at least trying to anyway. I'm worried less about the design aspect because I want to keep it fun. I want to trust the process and have fun with the process. Sometimes it's more about the, the process than the actual product. And planning for me is supposed to be a stress relief as I think about what I, what I have to do. And most of the time it's just realizing I'm stressing about all the things I have to do when I really don't have that much to do. <laughs> so planning helps me, uh, puts everything in perspective for me. So if I add the stress of, you know, trying to make the perfect spread, then it just takes the fun out of it. So I'm just trying to have fun with it. And this is one of those spreads that I'm just having fun with. Sometimes you just got to gotta not take yourself too seriously. And I'm adding checklists because I find those really helpful lately anyway with all this holiday stuff going on. So I'm adding some checklists here and there. I don't need one every day, but... Sometimes I like to just jot down things to do and cross them off, and it's a perfect place to do it in my planner. So it looks like I'm almost done with this. This was like the, another fast spread. I go back and forth with some other, the, uh, other stickers that I like that match, but I finally decide not to use. Okay, everyone, I think this is my spread for this week. Thank you so much for watching. You can catch me on Instagram at twinkleplansherday. Have a great week, guys.